Air, Fruit and New Sudan, Dr. Mark Samaha, along with a team of volunteers are leading the services to St. Lucia through training to physicians and also performing surgeries for patients in need. Dr. Samaha says such an initiative is important as it will promote the sharing of knowledge and learning from each other. Uh, I believe it is uh, greatly beneficial to patients of St. Lucia uh, to have the opportunity to have these services. It's beneficial, beneficial to the local doctors who can work with us and we can exchange uh, knowledge, information and experience. Uh, it is also beneficial for us uh, because we get to learn about how the medical system here is, the kinds of patients that, uh, the kind of issues that patients may uh, have to deal with, and through exchanges with the local doctors, we also obviously learn. Minister for Health and Wellness, Senator the Honorable Mary Isaac says, she is extremely grateful for the service Dr. Samaha is providing, which is extremely beneficial to St. Lucians. We have a young girl whose face was actually blown out with a flare gun, we have people with tumors, with deformities on their face. We have another gentleman that was electrocuted in a building in Castries, and he has been going through extensive surgery in Colombia. And here you have these doctors coming together here to assist us for free. So this is an invaluable service that we are getting here. And these are good Samaritans that decided that they are going to assist these people um, to make them look a lot better than they actually look right now. Medical Director for Victoria Hospital, Dr. Alicia Eugene, says this activity will serve as a platform for the surgeons to work side by side and acquire valuable knowledge. Right now in Victoria Hospital, we have one air, nose and throat surgeon, that's Dr. Sixtus Gabriel, and not only will be working along with them, but he has the opportunity to learn and exchange his own um, experiences here in St. Lucia, which may be very different from what we have in, the, in Canada. And not only will he have the ability to do some plastic surgery, but I think we have patients, especially some cancer patients, who have tumors on their, on their faces or persons with cleft palate. Clients with conditions pertaining to air, nose and throat from the Victoria and St. Jude hospitals benefited from medical services offered by Dr. Samaha and his team. From the communications unit in the Ministry of Health and Wellness, Miguel Morris at reporting.